Welcome back gamers. My name is Roll Easy and thank you for coming to the channel. I just wanted to say guys that video went even better than I thought. You know which one I'm talking about. The daily sell limit video that I posted earlier. If you guys haven't seen it I'll put a link in the description. I think it went very well. It's probably my favorite video I've posted so far other than the failed glitch video but I just thought it was great man. I had a fun time doing it. I hope you guys had fun watching it and that you learned something. All right, so go ahead and like the video, subscribe if you're new, and turn on post notifications right now, guys. All right, and I'm so proud of it that I wanted to come out with another dupe glitch, and this one's a different dupe glitch. It's not brand new, but you know what? It is working. Uh, it was actually revived, all right? I got to give a shout out to uh, Lost Gamer. He's over on Xbox. You should go check him out. Lost Gamer and Freight Train. What the fudge, actually. They came up with this one. It's really cool. I call it the, uh, the MOC Renovation Dupe Glitch. Reason being, you're gonna see it now. What you're gonna need, an MOC with a personal vehicle storage. You're gonna need a Fagio or an RH8. And I think that's it, honestly. So 5,000 bucks for a Fagio or a free RH8. You can use either one. And uh, yeah, personal vehicle storage in the MOC and the car you wanna dupe inside of the MOC. All right? Nothing more, nothing less. So check it out. I'm gonna show you guys in proof that it's gonna dupe with this plate. You do not need custom plates for this one, guys. This is different than the other dupe which I've been posting all weekend. Check it out. Look at this plate on the Fagio. 85 XIG328, all right? So remember IG328, remember whatever you wanna remember, all right? So you just gotta call up your Fagio or your RH8 and have it parked outside. Simple, right? Go inside of your MOC now, which is where the car you wanna dupe is. Mine's a retro. Remember, I always recommend Benny's vehicles. You want to do Benny's vehicles, not anything else. No supercars or anything. So I have the virus plate on it. Custom plate. You're going to go ahead and open up your internet. Any second now. All right. So open up your internet. You're going to go and renovate your MOC. Why well, it's called the renovation dupe. All right. So go ahead and go to bay three. You're going to go to personal vehicle storage and you're going to click on empty bay. Now, this glitch does cost you a bit of money, but this is on sale right now, so it's really not that much. And if you're doing retros, you're good. Click on buy once. Now hover over this buy. Don't press it yet. Hold right trigger or the gas at this point, and you're gonna press A and then Y, all right? And keep the right trigger held the whole time. So you saw that? I had right trigger held. I confirmed the buy by pressing A, and then I pressed Y about a second later, not even. And look, we end up outside. Local plate I got, guys. IG328. That's why you don't need custom plates on this one. This gives you a brand new, clean, generic plate that Rockstar has made. This is not a dirty dupe. This is a clean car right here, all right? No dirty dupes. This is already clean. Now, what you're gonna wanna do after that, go ahead and drive it to your MOC to the back. Look at that, unable to enter because you don't have the vehicle storage or the vehicle workshop. So you gotta, you gotta buy it. This is the renovation part again. This is what's gonna cost you money. But like I said, right now, this is all on sale, so take advantage. So if you look, you're gonna go to bay three, head over to the empty bay, and then you're gonna click personal vehicle storage. So you gotta pay 146 grand. It's all good, it's not that much money. Retro's worth almost a million. So go ahead and buy that bitch and give it a second to actually save and load up and you're gonna see there we go we got the option to enter the moc your old car is in the moc and now it's going to be transferred over to where your fagio or rha came from so now your clean ass fuck duplicate is there inside of the, your moc that's it dupe done nothing else to do after that that's a clean plate right there you can sell that as is if you want to put a custom plate go ahead but that is a clean car right there so once again, you do not need custom plates for this glitch. So anybody that is dupe detected that lost their plates, this is the glitch for you. This is how you want to be duping cars right now. At the moment, this is the only dupe glitch really working that you do not need custom plates for. All right, take advantage of this. I'm actually going to even show you one more time. Instead of using a Fagio this time, I'm going to use an RH8. All right. Now the LG RH8 is free. Just go ahead and go on Legendary Motorsport and pick one up. You can have it in any garage. You just got to be able to call it up. We recommend using Fagios because you can just call up a Fagio right from your motorcycle club menu a lot quicker. Um, and you know, you don't have a wait time. So you can see right here, I'm gonna call up my RH8 uh, once I find it. And I'm actually gonna end up having a wait time. So I'm gonna have to wait, I think it's like 30 seconds or something right now, but the wait time is five minutes in between calling your mechanic. You don't really want that, you know? Calling your mechanic back to back, you're, you know, you're gonna be waiting and shit. You wanna be doing this as fast as possible. So I recommend paying the five grand and using Fagios. Just fill up a whole garage of Fagios and you can just keep calling them, you know, go into your MOC, bam, you know, get it done. But this dupe is very easy, very quick. Only downside is, yeah, you do have to pay, it's 146 grand now. 
I think it's uh, it's maybe 180 grand or 200 grand or something like that. If you're uh, no, I think it's 240 actually. I think it's 240 thousand uh, dollars normal price if you're renovating your MOC by changing the the personal vehicle storage or empty bay to a personal vehicle storage. But since we switched it back to personal vehicle storage, right now, you know, our duplicate is in there. Clean duplicate inside the MOC. I just called for my RH8. Little tip, if you want your car to spawn a lot closer to you, look down, You maybe away from the street. I was just looking up and shit, but there it goes. It's parked right there. And I'm gonna show you the plate on this one too, as more proof that that's what's gonna transfer. Look at that, 29. Kind of missed it right there. When it comes back, we'll get the uh, we'll get the view. So yeah, 29 LJA 103. So remember JA 103 at the end. All right, JA 103. Remember that shit. I don't know why that bitch was scared going into my goddamn truck. All right. So once we get in there, we're gonna do the same thing. We're just gonna get inside of our car that we want to duplicate. And remember, you don't need a custom plate for this. You can see right here, I'm gonna dupe this regular clean generic plate. I got the 328 on it. Remember the other ones like JA something, just go back and you know, you'll see the video or you'll see the uh, the plate. So go ahead and go to Warstock. We're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna go to Bay 3, click on personal vehicle storage, make sure you got empty bay, hit A1 to, to buy it. Now this one you're gonna hold right trigger before you buy, hold right trigger and then press A and then Y. X on uh, PlayStation and then triangle on, uh, yeah, X and then triangle on PlayStation. And take a look, JA103, that's the plate from the LG RH8. You're tricking the game into thinking the car you're driving out is the car that you left outside. That's all that is. It, you're, just, you're just fooling the game, man. That's all glitches are. And once again, we can't store it because we don't have the personal vehicle storage. So we're gonna come back to our Warstock menu, go back to Bay 3, and we're gonna purchase it. So go to where empty bay is, click on personal vehicle storage. We're gonna play 146 grand. Go ahead and buy it and exit out of the internet. And once again, wait a few seconds. I've got my Patriot tire smoke going on. Can't really see it there in the grass though. And now you can store it. Now your other dupe that was in there is gonna be transferred over to where the RH8 came from. And now you have your new car in there. Simple as that guys, not much to it, all right? I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you got, you know, if you're a dirty player, this is the glitch for you. No custom plates needed. My name is Roll Easy. Everybody, if you haven't done so already, like the video, hit that blue thumbs up right fucking now, all right? Subscribe, hit the red button, turn on post notifications so you can be informed the second I come out with any more fresh and informative dope motherfucking content. I'm Roll Easy, and I'm out of here, guys. Take care.